this is the right point. So uh, I've dismantled the uh, the transaxle so as to just simply give me access to the main motor, which I may well actually just cut the case away from and uh, use separately because <coughs> I mean I can mount the gearbox components if I want to but I'm looking really to just drive this indirectly anyway uh, not directly but through a just a single reduction gear so as you can see I hope you can see it anyway it's turning so we've got the rotation going of course and it's uh, there's the three phase input through the IGBTs. This is not this is a circuit that I've used before, so this isn't anything different. The only difference is I've actually stripped away the car from it, <laughs> so it's now just powering the uh, gearbox. This um, so I've got a <coughs> this is the sun wheel, and normally connected to this gear here on the top is a chain which takes it out to the rest of the gearbox, and it's got like a a kind of uh, split case there which is spinning so you can't see it too well and then there's a like a disc gear which gears <coughs> connects into the bottom of that uh, and then there's the central shaft down there and it all separates there's about four components there I can't remember and I just put them on just to make it so that it's easier just to spin it if I need to so the shaft itself just comes out to a, a uh, oh, I'll show you actually <coughs> so the shaft from the actual motor comes out to now then let me check it's not this but it's pretty it's pretty much the same as that okay I've just dropped a bearing so that the actual shaft comes out to that you see which it's uh, let's put my light on <coughs> so you've got when it comes on so y you can see it's just a spline shaft at the end of the day and it's pretty much the same as that. That comes out up from the motor. I mean, I've got this on the. Uh, this is off the other one, which is me, which actually goes into it, like that. <laughs> Rather than comes out, but it, it's the same affair. It, oh dear! Have to clean that now. What a bugger! Anyway, okay. So that's that, and uh, we've got the actual motor out, <laughs> and it's running. On your three phase, we've got. <coughs> oh, it's just dropped. Uh, so we've got temperature on uh, our. Uh, I marked them up so we know what the connections actually are because I never marked the other ones up. So we've got P. Oh, let's do it on this one. P, so that's the positive, which is coming off the bottom rail. And then the N, which is coming off the top rail, which is the negative. Okay, and then we've got the inputs. So we've got high side and low side these are the three phases and then we've got uh, 